next to us. <laughs> Good morning, you beautiful cats. Little ones exploring the cavities of the of the dam, seeing what's creeping around in that area. If I'm not mistaken, I think the one we are looking at is Shongile, and the one closer to us is Karula. Just by look, looking at the faces. Maybe some of the viewers can help me with the age of Karula and the age of Shongile. Maybe we can start there and then start figuring things out together. There's a perfect example of that camouflage. See how quickly they just disappear into an area. Some Egyptian geese making a bit of a racket, making a bit of noise about the presence of the leopard. They're also right in the middle of the dam. And now they're heading back out to shore. I'm just Thank you very much Charles. Karula is about 12 years old. We've got some water buck in our area as well. Just in front of us. <clears throat> they are very alert and moving around. I had a quick view of one somewhere just behind the termite mount. M moving to Steph, thank you very much. So the cubs are around 10 months old, just under a year. Yeah, these water buck are coming out to our left. I just want to let the guys know that we have found them. So I don't want to keep this all to ourselves. We want to share it with the rest of the world. Good morning, all stations. Toilet to Mafazing, where Twin Dams um, currently mobile west away from the dams. Every now and then I might have to chat to the other guides and let them know what's happening. Let's quickly shoot around and see where they are heading. Those water buck are just to the left. I'm making a big loop around the leopards. They had a view of them earlier and you could see all their ears, everything just listening and seeing what's happening. I haven't seen any very young water buck in the area, so I don't think they're in any trouble from becoming prey to these leopard. Let's carry on. I don't want to lose these cats again. Let's stick with them. <clears throat> Luckily they are settling down. 